Let's see my class. Yes. He was one of my best students. Yeah, he, 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 he was, his marks were like 80. 80 and above. He struggled with a, a white boy that was in my class. Yoga. Yoga was very intelligent. 85, 90. These guys were intelligent. These were the two. But he was the one that matched with the guy. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> did, you, did you see me talk about the rest? <laughs> okay. What is the username? Oh, sorry. Um, this, what's the username for Holly Dixon again? You know, I've forgotten this usernames. Um, Holly Dixon. It's um, it's Holly, right? Okay. So let's log in. Let's go back. We go to the start, sign out. We're going to reset. We're going to be resetting the computer account. So we're going to use the user Holly because she has the permission. So we log in. Holly Dixon. Everything is up and running. Okay. Next, we go to the server manager. Okay, now we're going to go to the Active Directory. Just wait for the server manager to refresh. Okay, it's finished refreshing, so we go to the tools, we click on Active Directory Users and Computers. You guys remember earlier on that we're asked to, you guys remember earlier on that we're asked to, we're asked to move the computer accounts to the branch office one. Is that not correct? So that's my computer account, which is uh, trainer, trainer PC. So um, what we're going to do, we're going to um, we're going to reset the computer. So how do we reset the computer? Can you right click? Can you right click, guys? Right click. Do you see the word reset account? You see reset account, guys. Okay, can you click reset? You say, are you sure you want to reset this account? We're going to click yes. Is that not correct? So you click yes. It says account was what? Was reset what? Successfully, right? So click OK. Now, we're going to switch to client one, our client computer system. We're going to try to Login as um, uh, MED and uh, Medals, and we're going to see what's going to happen. So let's go back, start, let's click sign out. Okay, let's log in again. Let's see what's going to happen. What does it say? Well, between the workstation and the primary domain did what? Failed. So how do we fix the problem? How do we fix the problem? We have to rejoin the computer back to what? The domain. And there's only one person that has the ability to do that, and that's who? The administrator. So let's go back and log in as the administrator on the client's computer. So we'll go to other users, we'll type in administrator.
GPCE. So I'm logging in as the domain user, as the administrator. Okay, are you all logged in as well? Okay, right click, then go to what? Control what? Panel. Okay, do you see system and security? Click on it. Then can you go to systems? Then you see advanced settings, system settings. Click on it. Do you see the computer name? Do you see network ID? Click on network ID. And what are the options that are there? He says this computer is part of a business what? I want to use it to connect to other computers at the network. The other one says what? Mm -hmm. You say? This is a home computer. So let's click next. So what's the next selection? My company uses a network with a domain. My company uses a network without a domain. Is it using a domain? Yes. So we click next. And of course, you need the following information. Can you see that? So we'll click next. The administrator will type in the what? The password. We'll click what? Next. It says your computer training has been found on the domain. Would you like to use this? Yes. Now, what's the next step? So, we don't want to add it, so we say do not, right? So, we say do not add a domain user to the account. Click next. And what? Finish right. So it's asking us to restart the computer. So let's restart the system. Now after that, we're going to try to log in as as what? We're going to log in as what? We're going to log in as Med, and we're going to see if the computer will be authenticated. So I'll just wait for the computer to restart. One class, one class, one class. So let's log in as Med now. Other users, MED password. Wow, is it going through? Exactly. So when the computer gets into a way whereby it's no longer able to connect to the domain, go to the computer, reset it, and follow the step I did. Log into the local machine with the administrator account, and you'll be able to reset the computer back to the domain. Are we following? So what we did was to now rejoin the computer back to the domain system. It has been joined, right? You can see that the computer has been joined, and if you go to the start menu there, if you click on the start, you can see Eddie Medals, and it's back to the same position. Are we following? Yes. The reason why you saw this X is because of the internet connection. Okay. Um, which lab practicals did we skip? Folders. Work folders. No, no, no. For work folders, we had issues because yeah, of the, issues, yeah. the group policy settings. Yeah, we've talked yeah. about that already. So it's basically just... Yeah. Uh, <laughs>